find the top of the jaws on the vise. So we're right down there. That's good. By cutting that down, I've got rid of that rounded edge, so I need to put a rounded edge back on there again. Just file straight down to start off with, because it's easier and it gets rid of that immediate sharp corner sticking up. When you got it down about yay far, then you can get rid of the other edge that you've made and that top edge that you've made and then go round. And that gives you a nice nice round edge. Get rid of some burrs. Okay. And there's the shape I want there. further than that. Plenty of blade left but uh, I think that's long enough. This is also my first attempt at making a, a folding knife so I don't want to get too ambitious. And this is a very poor blade. I mean it's good steel um, hand forged from what I can see of the tang um, but it's very badly worn and uh, a very thin blade, so I'm using the thickest end of the blade I can and making it fairly short. It's still a good length, I think, by the time I finish for a folder. Take that tape off of there very carefully. You don't need that bit. Maybe that bit can make another smaller folding knife. We'll place that over the part that uh, I'm finished with. Now you see I've got another sharp corner, sharp point here now. I need to get rid of that. And there's also a slight curve which I need to get rid of, so I need to round that into that tip. And we'll do that next. See what it looks like as a whole blade. There you go. That's not bad, is it? From what it was. We've actually uh, made a decent sized, decent shaped blade out of it. That's good. I'm happy with that.